Do-it-yourself repairs are surfacing in some Chicago neighborhoods. The city is sending out a call for people to stop the stopgap measures. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross is live in Bronzeville with this original report. Jeremy. Good evening, Rob. Chicago firefighters reminding us that wherever you see a fire hydrant, there should be another water source a few hundred feet away. We see one in that direction. We see one in that direction. But it is this fire hydrant earlier today that was simply unsightly. This story doesn't start with a gush of news. It begins with a drip. It's because you see it's still running. It continues with concerns about a fall or a slip. Sliding on the ice. Duct tape. It wrapped the raincoat around and it got the duct tape and wrapped the duct tape around trying to stop it from leaking. Not sure what that is. Leaking is still leaking. Broken for months and months. Somewhere underneath the makeshift band-aid for a leak, you'll see the fire hydrant in 43rd and Champlain. This tail of the tape extends to downtown as well. Pictures show now fixed hydrants in Wabash and another bagged and taped on state. You don't take nothing to knock that up. You fix that. If your house is on fire, do you depend on that hydrant? Oh, no, no, man. Well, if they had seen the tape and plastic on it, they would have immediately gone to the next hydrant. Gary Litherland of the Department of Water says firefighters would instead go to a hydrant less than 300 feet away. He calls the tape jobs something neighbors did. Our call to his office fixed the problem, and he's calling on neighbors to alert the city so future leaks don't linger. We try to get to them all within 24 hours. If you see a fire hydrant in the city of Chicago that needs service, the city is reminding you this evening to call 311 or visit their website and fill out a report. Live in Bronzeville, Jeremy Ross, CBS2 News. Rob. Okay, Jeremy, thank you.